hi guys so it's me and welcome um right now something super exciting is happening on youtube we are having a wonderful dollar store collaboration it's called the dollar store art challenge and i hope you join us if you do please use the hashtag dollar store art challenge but in the description of this video there will be links to ton up to a lot of videos um where we all took a dollar store challenge and we created beautiful piece of art with a budget of $15 from a dollar store. Um, some people in um, Europe and in other countries, um, they don't have like a dollar tree or anything like that. So they went to discount stores and um, that kind of thing um, in thrift stores and secondhand stores and they created projects too. So it's all about doing art on a budget and I think sometimes we restrict ourselves um, when we're creating art. We think we need all these fancy products and all this stuff in order to create a beautiful piece of art, and that's just not the case. So what I'm gonna show you that I created is this beautiful art doll. Um, she was such a pleasure to make. Um, I did have to cut out some of the footage though, so you won't see every step, but you'll definitely kind of get an overview um, of how I created her, and I am in love with her. I put her on my, um, in my art room and I just love looking at her. I keep picking her up and I keep her close and everything on here is from the dollar store um, with the exception of gesso and paints. That's it. Everything else I got um, from the dollar store. Um, even the newspaper was from um, a newspaper that I got at the Dollar Tree. So everything on here is from the dollar store and I hope that this just illustrates to you that you can create beautiful art.
yourself is over, but you're telling a lie. See, so you standing at a fork in the road. I know. So get up out your feelings and get ready to go. Let me introduce some people tonight. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, they crazy, broken people making wonderful lives. Let me show you how to live instead of just getting by. It's hard, but it's better with someone by your side. You say you're about to give up hope. Well, I hope you hear my voice saying, don't let go. I know I've been there for a moment before. And it's hard fighting pain, respecting the choke. Hey, hey, keep your heart to the sky. Cause every day, any day can bring a new surprise. One love for the people going through hard times. And welcome to the club of the ones who survive. Too. Let's go. to record it took hours to make this um, but it's totally worth it I'm super excited about the results so what I did was I just decoupaged on top of the newspaper um, my um, book page which I got a book from the dollar store that's what I used um, and I did her arms and her head and all that stuff and I also added a little um, what do you call this a bun with cheesecloth so um, I don't think that's in the video because um, it got late and I couldn't record because my lighting wasn't that good um, but yeah but it was super fun to make so now I'm going to continue on with the process but I really love how she turned out she stands up just like that and her little arms and everything she's so cute okay so I'm going to continue on to the next step the next step that I'm going to do is I'm going to add some white paint or gesso I'll probably use gesso um, because part of this challenge is that you can um, use things from your stash as far as like basic materials like paint and um, gesso and that kind of thing and stamps and stencils I'm going to use some stencils from um, the that I got from the dollar store maybe I'm not sure and then I also got a stamp from the dollar store too so I'm gonna try to stick to that also too I have a little bottle of um, Mod Podge that I got from the dollar store too so I'll be using that um, Mod Podge too um, but you could just as easily use um, white goo goo and this worked great I used all of this for um, adding everything onto her the different layers of paper and everything and she's nurse she's nice and sturdy now on the inside if you saw how I made the body there's a little piece of um, paper in there so I can hold her while I paint her with the gesso and I don't know if I'm going to paint her with color or not I haven't decided um, so I'm just going to stop talking and let you guys watch the process but I wanted to tell you I'm going to definitely streamline the process um, because it's not that hard to make it's just a little time consuming and I was kind of experimenting myself so I think I have the technique down I wish she had more of a neck but um, it, the hardest part was getting the head to stick on so that's something that um, that I need to work on but I still love her she's so cute she's adorable and I can't wait to decorate her okay so I'm gonna stop talking we're gonna add gesso and I will let you watch the process and I'll be back at the end and we'll talk about um, what you guys think so keep watching is bothering you still you look beautiful tonight that's right Ooh. girl your sisters are jealous of you cause you're so wonderful inside that's right
When you got it and it's not about the bling But still we rocking it My chain's around your neck So here you drive Where to next? Just going and going, you're just going and going, we're just going. 
giveaway um, as part of this art challenge and to enter the giveaway you just need to click the link below it will start today and all the rules and um, all the information will be in the description box of this video um, the, the reward is if you're in the states in the USA um, you will get a $20 gift certificate to Dollar Tree now if you're not in the states you can still enter and you'll receive um, 20 US dollars sent to a PayPal account there will only be one winner but um, just so that person can kind of join in the fun um, you do need to watch at least five videos in order to be entered um, into the giveaway and if you click the link um, below it'll say giveaway link um, it will take you to my blog and you just follow the instructions there and you can enter and I will announce the winner on Monday and all the information's there. It's super simple um, to follow, really fun. Um, yeah, so I'm so excited. There's so many wonderful projects um, that you guys will get to watch. Um, and I hope that you check them out. I hope that this just lights, lights you up inside and it inspires you just to create beautiful art that you love. Um, just using, you know, basic materials um, that, that you use creatively that um, just to make beautiful art that makes you happy or gifts for your friends or whatever you like to do with your art so I'm super excited um, to be a part of this collaboration and I really hope that you check out all the other videos because I've watched some of them and they are absolutely amazing and you will not be disappointed and say hi tell them that I sent you um, yeah subscribe to their channel see what they have going on um, there's so many undiscovered gems on YouTube and um, this is a great way for us to find them <laughs> and if you're interested um, in joining the collaboration um, please use the hashtag um, dollar store art challenge um, so we can find your pictures and send me pictures like um, 
my email address is in the description of this video and if you do one of these projects please 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 send it to me um, the only thing um, so you get the $15 budget and then like you can use just basic art supplies from your stash nothing too fancy like paints and you know like um, glue and that kind of thing um, but everything else is just materials from the dollar store so it was super fun okay and I'm sorry for the long introduction but we're gonna get started on this wonderful project and I really hope you enjoy the video um, she is so inspiring to me and I just love her so much and I'm just amazed um, that I was able to create something so beautiful so I really hope that you enjoy the process and I'm gonna stop talking and keep watching bye bye guys doing better than before but still I got a long way and just maybe